Plastics is used for almost anything in our life. We use it for packaging, for clothing, for cars, for electronics. Everywhere you look is plastics, plastics, plastics. At the end of the life of these products, it's getting to landfill. From there, it goes into the land and it basically gets back to us through our food, our drinks and the air that we breathe. We consume a credit card worth of plastics every week. Biotic is going to change that. My name is Adi Goldman. I'm uh, from Fasaba, married, three kids, uh, and now CEO and co-founder of Biotic. At Biotic, we have a vision, a world where plastic is no longer a concern. The consumer uses the product the exact same way and after use, can toss it to any trash without the need to recycle, collect, or worry about it. We want to replace fossil-based plastics with something that is as value as plastic, cost-effective, can fit existing machinery, and at the end of the line, looks and feels the same as plastics. The whole story started uh, in 2019, I love traveling. In the last few years, everywhere we go, we see the piles of trash piling around. And one of the trips when we came back home, I tried to explain to my kids, why is this important for us to keep the environment safe, to collect the trash. And while I am explaining to them about the plastic issues, we looked around and we realized everything around us is plastic. Their dolls, their bags, the TVs, plastics. We realized we need to find a solution for that myself and Iran, my partner, we used the opportunity that we come from the industry and decided to go and find a solution so that our kids will have a better future to live in. We are growing microorganisms that are producing a polymer which can serve the vast majority of plastic demand today, replacing it as a one-on-one. -on -one. This solution exists since the early 80s, but has a lot of struggles. Most of bacteria that produce this uh, polymer produce a single type of material, which makes it very difficult to fit existing production lines. In addition to that, the product itself is very expensive, six, seven times more than plastics. We're working on fermentation. It's a very common practice in the world today. Everybody is using agriculture-based sugars. We also can use sugars, but it's a competition with food and arabalen and therefore the cost is very high when you get to the materials and also the availability but we have identified that if we go to the ocean the opportunity is much bigger algae grows everywhere in the world they grow very fast so they can be harvested every week to four weeks instead of a season of agriculture growing which takes three or four months it grows all year long, so there's no seasonality. At the end of the line, it produces sugars in enough quantity that is cost-efficient enough for our process. We're not competing with our Arab land. We are using the algae with the seawater, so we don't need to clean it. We don't need to wash it. It's a non-sterile environment and a process that works continuously. So basically, we have reduced all the energy cost that is very heavy. It allows us to be very cost-efficient towards plastics. And from here, the sky's the limit. This polymer, can be modified to fit any product throughout the entire supply chain, from the production of food and beverage packaging all the way to automotive, textile, and electronics. Our technology is ready. It has gone through multiple steps of proof of concept, and it is ready to go to the world, making the change and becoming a world leader in plastic alternative, replacing the need for polluting fossil-based plastics with fully biodegradable ones.